Now that you've assembled your last ball game system, it's time to set it up in play. What you're going to do is establish your play area by laying the game straight out as you see here. Start at the furthest end of the play area by inserting the ground spikes approximately four feet apart. The next step, attach your lobster clamps to each side of the bearing assembly located at the top of each pole. Now, by twisting the couplings, extend each section of pole to its maximum length until all sections are at the maximum length. Simply lean this pole into the other side of the play area. Once you're at the other side of the play area, pull the top tension rope taut so you know where your pole is going to be established. Now approximately four feet from that pole is where you're going to want to insert your other ground spike. Same as the other side, four feet apart again. Repeat the same step by attaching the lobster clamps to each side of the bearing assembly located at the top of each pole. Now twist your couplings to their full extended length. Ensure your top tension rope becomes tight like this. Then simply wrap your guy rope around the head of the ground spike. Ensure that the poles are vertical and straight and your top tension rope is as tight as it can be by simply wrapping the guy ropes on the opposite side around the top of the spikes. Once you see the top tension rope is tight, now your anti-tangle bearing assembly is going to work flawlessly. You're now ready to play. To change sports with other balls, simply grab your ball of choice, come to the center of the game, at the middle where the O-ring, it simply clips on just like that. Take your other ball off. You're now ready to play another Elastiball sport. Hope you have.